So this is the last one. If it's all right, I'm going to perform this because I can never perform it in schools. There is a swear word in there. Here, there's only one swear word, but I'm going to say it 22 times uh, in the poem. <laughs> um, so I find in this country, we have this weird thing where poets like get so caught up in trying to tell people what they are and aren't allowed to do with poetry. We had a situation where um, Holly McNish released a collection called Plum and someone was asked to review it and they said they wouldn't review it in the PN review because none of it classed it, it wasn't poetry, like an entire <laughs> book, and said, no, I, it's not. And you're thinking, well, you write, po you, you write poetry. You've got a ho horse in the race, right? Like, that's absurd. Um, there was a big lecture that was given as well recently in London that I, I saw um, and it was about how K Tempest will not be remembered in 100 years' time. Like, like some guy had spent all his time doing this. I just thought, Jesus, like, why are we spending all this time trying to police it and everything else? And I think the most exciting poetry we'll hear will not be like mine or like anyone else's. And I just think, yeah, I just think it's mad. So this is my last poem. It's called It's Still a Fucking Poem. Uh, and it's about that. For anyone who ever feels that maybe they don't get it right, or you, you can't get it wrong, it's cool. Um, so it's called It's Still a Fucking Poem. It goes like this. If it talks of things you don't believe in, it's still a fucking poem. If the meter isn't even, it's still a fucking poem. If it isn't all that intricate, it's still a fucking poem. If you don't feel all that into it, it's still a fucking poem. If it's popular, too jocular, if the rhyme scheme gets on top of you, if the metaphors are propping up an argument that's sloppy, if it's written by some children, still a fucking poem. Graffiti to a building, still a fucking poem. If it's scribbled at a workshop, it's still a fucking poem. Or by someone you've not heard of, it's still a fucking poem. If it won all the awards, if it left you feeling bored, if it's half as good as yours, it's still a fucking poem. If it isn't all that um, ambitious, it isn't all that literate, it doesn't attacking parliament, if the heading has a footnote, if the ending sort of spirals out, if it will not be remembered by the world a hundred years from now, it's still a fucking poem, right? It's still a fucking poem. It's still as much a poem as any piece you know of, and it's not how you would write it, but it's still a fucking poem. And you don't think that you like it, but it's still a fucking poem. And you can cry that it's appalling, but it's still a fucking poem. And you aren't that important, right? You're not a fucking poem. You're just a fucking poet stuffed with too much guff from poems. Just leave it to the rest of us or go and write a poem. Cool, thank you very much. Have a lovely day. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, we'd appreciate it if you could hit the like button, if you could hit the subscribe button, and make sure to ring that bell icon so you don't miss any updates from us in the future. If you wanna go that extra mile and support us a little further, we do have a Patreon channel with loads of exclusive goodies and you can sign up for as little as a dollar a month. We appreciate your help, guys, and hopefully we'll see you again soon.